Gustav, uh, you guys were here last year. What's the difference in your mind? How is it different to you this time around? Uh, I don't know. It, it feels a little different. I feel like we're not satisfied at all. We're, uh, we know how hard it is to get here, and we're really going to take care of this uh, opportunity. All right, you get you did a great job, obviously, in these first three three rounds. You're involved with with Aaron and with your whole group, really shutting down really good offensive players. You have McDavid, you have Drysaddle, you have this group. Is there any different approach for you guys, or is it the same thing? Like do the job. Yeah, like uh, we don't want we do not want to change too much. Like we want to play the way we got that that got us here, and uh, for sure we gotta be aware when McDavid's out there with his speed and everything, but. We do not want to change too much. I just want to ask you just quick about your journey because you were drafted by Vancouver. You kind of kicked around. You're in Chicago. You're in Carolina. You come here on waivers, and you've blossomed into, you know, one of the best defensemen in this league. I mean, for, for kids who are watching this and they, they're, you know, trying to make their way in, in anything in life, just give me an idea of the perseverance it takes just to keep going and, and, and looking for that opportunity. Uh, first of all, you got to believe in yourself uh, and really, really work hard every day. Like that's that's what I try to do when when things got hard. I just try to head down and work really hard, and then whenever the opportunity was going to come, I was going to be ready for it. Right. Like in life here in South Florida, you seem like you're settled here for a while now. Yeah, no, uh, we love it here. Uh, me and my family love it here. So sun sun is not bad, so <laughs> we love it. All right, well, listen, thanks for your time. Good luck in the final. Thank you.